What's up everybody and thanks for tuning in. In this video, we're going to show you how to install the Boomba Racing Short Throw Shifter into the 10th generation Honda Civic. Now we use a Civic Sport for this guide, but this also works for the SI and Type R models. There's just a couple more wiring harnesses to unplug. Here's what you'll need to complete this install. A 10 millimeter socket, Phillips screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver, a really small flathead screwdriver, interior trim removal tools, hook and pick tools, a plastic mallet, and synthetic grease. Begin by removing the left and right side center console trim pieces by pulling them up and in. Remove the two screws holding the shifter boot assembly. Pull up on the shift boot assembly and disconnect the electrical wiring harnesses. The SI and Type R models will have a couple extra harnesses. Unscrew the shift knob by turning it counterclockwise. Pry out the climate control panel and disconnect the wiring harnesses behind it. Remove the upper deck screws. There's going to be three of them. Two up by the radio and one by the shifter. Remove the upper deck assembly by pulling it up and out. Pry out the power outlet panel and disconnect the wiring harnesses behind it. Remove the lower deck shelf by pulling it up and out. Back to the shifter, remove the spring clip and disconnect the side cable link. Disconnect the shift cable link by spreading the spring clip apart. Lift the locking tab and turn the cable counterclockwise to disconnect the two shifter cables from the base. Remove the wire harness clip from the base. There's going to be two of them. Remove the four screws securing the shifter assembly to the floor. You can now pull out the entire shifter assembly. Pry off the blue end cap from the shifter, but save it, we're gonna use this later. Pinch in the locking tabs and remove the side shift arm from the base. Remove the centering spring. Slide a small flat screwdriver under the tab and carefully move it to the outside. There'll be four of these total. Always move the screwdriver from the inside to the outside of the shifter assembly. Hold the shifter assembly upside down and tap the bottom with a plastic mallet to pop the shifter out. Pop the collar off of the shifter and save it. We're going to use it later. Grease all ball joints with synthetic grease and install the collar and the cap. Press the shifter and collar into the base. Make sure you hear the latches snap in. Reinstall the centering spring. Slip the two ends into the grooves and flip the coiled end outwards, separating the two ends. Reinstall the side shift arm. You're now ready to put everything back together. Reassembly is simply the reverse of disassembly. Position the shifter assembly into place and bolt it to the floor. Attach the cables to the base and connect the side and bottom shift linkage. Make sure that the locking clips are in place. Reinstall the lower deck shelf assembly. 
Reconnect the electrical harness and reinstall the power outlet panel. Reinstall the upper deck assembly and secure it to the dashboard. Reconnect and install the climate control panel. Reconnect the electrical harnesses for the shift boot assembly and secure it to the upper deck. Reinstall the side trim. That wraps up this install guide. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.